Are you the kind of person who sometimes feel like an alien among other people? I mean, when you are in a group conversation, you understand what they are talking about, but you never understand why they are talking about such things in the first place. You listen to them because you don't want to be rude, but otherwise you are never interested in their gossip. If this describes you, congratulations, you are not alone. You are among those people who have a highly imaginative mind, and that makes you an idealist. You do care about money, about having a nice house, about having a car, about wearing decent clothes, and also about eating good food. But you don't think about these things as your purpose in life. That's why discussions about them don't seem appealing to you. Having an imaginative mind means that you are not enslaved to material things. You see yourself as a free human, and you believe that material things are made for you. You are not made for them. You are the master of your life, and they are merely a part of your life to help you live the way you want. You got something to do. It might be for fun, or it might relate to the lives of others, or you might want to change something in the society, or probably you might be thinking to achieve a certain big goal, or perhaps you might like to do anything which you enjoy while doing it. Your mind is always busy with your project. You certainly do all those things which are important for your survival, but your primary goal is always your passion. You can call it your purpose, your goal, your dream, or your mission, but that's the project of your life. That's what you are living for. Wait a minute. What? What are you talking about? You must be out of your mind. How are you going to do that? You should really be serious about your life. Don't waste your time. Don't make castles in the air. You are smart and should do something for the betterment of your life. Wow. A moment ago, you were flying in the air. You were feeling like all your dreams will come true. And all of a sudden, just a few words brought you back to reality. You begin to question your goals, your direction, and everything you have been thinking all your life. You even feel like you are wrong. We all know that this happens non-stop in our society. People bring down the hopes, dreams, and aspirations of other people with just their negative words. Why does this happen and, more importantly, are you wrong for having such idealistic thoughts? You are definitely not wrong. Neither your plans are wrong nor your direction in life. You have simply encountered a person whose perspective about life is a little different than yours. Everyone sees the world around them in a unique way. The same world means different to different natured people. We are going to explain their perspective in detail in another video. Here, we just want to clarify that your direction is not only right, but actually, those who think like you are the real conquerors of the world. People like you can think out of the box. Your imaginative mind can let you think beyond your potential. You are creative, and creative people have changed the world more times than we can count. We can take the example of the person who thought of generating light out of a bulb for the first time or the person who thought of talking to other people through wires, or the first person who thought of flying in the air. The point is, they all thought just like you. If they would have listened to others, we might not have experienced the world that we are living in now. Your idea and goal are important, and because of that, you are equally important. You are important not only for your own self, but also for other people. That's because if you succeed in achieving what you want, it will surely impact the lives of others. So now it's your responsibility to take care of your dreams. You surely know how to achieve your goals, but you need tons of positive good energy. You need motivation, and your imaginative mind is there to help you boost your energy. Just don't let anyone question your dream, no matter who it is. Keep your project secret until you find someone who has the same mentality as yours, who is optimistic just like you. When you find this kind of person and you share your project with him, the first thing you will hear would be, Wow! Amazing! He will listen to you and your ideas with patience and excitement. He might also narrate some successful stories of other related people. 
His positive energy will encourage you to speak for hours. You will feel comfortable opening up to him, and you will definitely feel proud of what you are trying to achieve. You see, you and your dream are important all the time, but your motivation changes while talking to people of different natures. Here you felt discouraged, and here you felt motivated. Let's highlight what we learned in this discussion. You don't understand other people's gossip because your priorities are different. And they criticize your goals because of the same reason. You and your dreams are important, not just for you, but for others as well. It's important to look for people who have the same interests as you. And finally, it's not important for everyone to approve your project. And it's certainly not important for everyone to understand and value what you do in your life. Okay, Ragazzi, before you guys begin to practice over these points, it's time to help your fellow aliens. This is an eye-opening topic for so many people all over the world. If it helped you in any possible way, it means it will surely help others as well. So be generous and share this video on social media. Send it to your friends in private message. And don't forget to subscribe to Solid Clarity to watch more interesting videos like this. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay positive and never stop flying.